How do you perform a case insensitive string compares? Let's have a look. Let's start with a couple of strings as examples, an original string and a string we're going to see if it's contained within the original. Now our first implementation is very simple and actually does work in most situations. We're going to take both strings, the original and the contained, convert them both to lowercase, and now that they're in the same case, string.contains will do the correct thing and tell us true or false, is it contained? There's a couple of potential issues though. We have two extra string allocations that aren't really necessary. So it would be nice if we could get rid of these two lower calls. And the second problem is one to do with culture. If all of your customer's data is in the same locale that your program is running in, not a problem. But what happens if you have data from multiple countries? One of your customers is Turkish, another is German, another is English. Then you're gonna to have to do something like the following. You're going to have to pass in the culture to the two lower call. Otherwise, it's going to use the current culture and the culture that the program is running in may not match the same culture as every one of your customers. But this doesn't solve the first problem of multiple string allocations. So we move on to another implementation, which is to move on to the, the actual contains, string.contains call, which removes the need for the two string allocations. So that solves that problem. And we can pass in the second parameter to tell it to ignore the case. So it's the case insensitive comparison. However, it will always use the current culture. If all of your data is from the same culture as the running process, this is your solution and will work perfectly fine. If, however, some of your users have data in different countries, because you have a multi-tenant scenario, then this isn't going to really work. And so you're going to move on to the final solution, which is you need to create a culture for your individual customer's location. Let's say in this case, TR-TR. This is Turkey, so our customer in Turkey, I want to treat their data as Turkish language. And then using the culture information's compare capability, I'm going to say, look up the index of the contained data in the original. I'm going to ignore the case again, and that will tell me in a language specific way whether it's contained. Now there is a small gotcha here. There isn't a contains method in this compare info. Therefore, we've used the very similar index of. And the only difference of, for that is you need to say uh, not equal to minus one. But otherwise, it does the same thing. So there you go. If you don't care about culture, use this solution. If you do care about culture, you'll have to create culture info instances and perform a culture specific index of. I hope that's helpful. If it is, hit the like button so that others can find the same solution. Until next time, happy coding.